Hey kiddos, it's me, Mr. Broviak. As you've noticed, I'm not here. Uh, hopefully, today's videos go smoother than last time I was gone. Fingers crossed. Um, I had not planned on being gone today, or I would have told you guys that we had a family emergency thing pop up, so I'm out today. Hopefully back tomorrow, depending on how the family thing goes. I'll tell you guys more about it when I get back, if need be, if you're curious or care. Um, but yeah, I apologize for being gone. It was not what I was planning on today. Um, you don't need anything besides a writing utensil. Um, and that's maybe pretty much should be it, which we'll walk you through here in a moment. Um, schedule's still the same the rest of the week. The only small change will be, um, hopefully as long as my emergency gets done and things are good. I should be back at some point this week and we'll figure it out from there. Um, but we're not going to get a chance to do the discussion from yesterday today. We're going to push that off till Wednesday. We will do it when I come back, which whatever day I come back, we'll have the conversation with you then because I do want to hear your opinions. Um, so that'll be the only thing that's really changed. The rest of the week should pretty much be the same. If you've not submitted the questions from yesterday, then look at that. You got lucky. You have extra time to get it done. If it's not done by the time I come back and the issue is over, then that's when I get a chance to torture you. I'll still charge you the B points for not turning it in, bad kid, bad. But on the bright side, I won't uh, make you stand until I get back. So that's something, right? So baby steps on that one. Um, the Heroes Hall passes. Um, if you were absent, Mrs. Randall has your pass. I gave them to her to hand out to the kids who were absent because I didn't want you guys to have to wait until I got back. Uh, so you should be good to go on those. If you're wanting to turn in your yellow pass, hold on to it until I'm actually back in the room. I don't want you to give it to the sub in case it gets lost or anything like that. So do not give it to anyone. You keep it until you physically see me so we can make sure nothing bad happens to it. Because if you give it to the sub and it disappears and you tell me later, you're out of luck. It's just gone. So don't be that child. Same thing here. I'm apologizing. We didn't get a chance to do this today. Uh, we will get a chance. And if for some reason my emergency lasts longer than I wanted it to, well, I didn't want it to happen at all. That's why it's an emergency. But lasts longer than I'm expecting it to, I will give you a chance to do this. If we have to extend it, then so be it. Uh, I'm not going to rob you of it because, you know, these things were out of our hands and we couldn't control them. So I'm not going to count that against you. If you've not done the in-class writing from yesterday, this is just my reminder to you to make sure you submit them. I will be uh, grading them when my free time, and then I will be uploading those to Canvas and then to Skyward. And then anyone who does not have theirs, I'll be tracking you down and making you have to turn it in so I can be nice to you. So if you are gone yesterday, make sure you take care of this so it is no longer going to be an issue. All right. Um, let's see. So this will be the, the statement thing that we didn't get a chance to do with you guys. And so, again, we will take care of this whenever I am back and with you guys physically, in person, in front of you, we will have this discussion. Because, uh, again, I do want to hear your opinions, and I am interested in them, and I don't want to rob you of that. So I will have this conversation with you when I get back. All right, so your new novel that you're going to be getting today, I wanted to be there to hand them out to you, partly because um, when I hand out the books, I get to throw them across the room at you. And I don't get to throw the books at you today because I'm not here. And I'm hoping that brings you as much sadness as that brings me. Regular class, you are getting my Shadow Club books. They should have a pink number on the bottom. You are assigned a specific number. Uh, so I believe looking at it, um, if you are in period one, your books are between one and 30. If you are in period five, it's between number 31 and 56. If you're in period six, you're between 57 and 83. And period seven, you're between 84 and 109. And you'll get those books today from the sub, if the sub has not already given them to you. Regular kids, you don't get to keep the book forever. You get to hold on to it until we get to until we get done with it. But I do eventually someday need these back from you, which is why you see there's writing in them. Uh, these are kids' books from the past that I bought off of them for candy and B points. So you do not get to keep them forever. You get to keep them today. You get to take them home today. You get to hold on to it until we finish the whole book, but you don't get to keep it forever and ever. My advanced class, uh, you do get to keep your book forever and ever. This is yours. And regular kids, don't freak out. There's a book later this year that you get to keep and they don't. So it equals out. It just happened to be this one. Outside, for the regular, my advanced kids, so the outsiders, you get to keep it. It does not matter which book you get. They're all the exact same. They're brand new and fresh. 
Uh, so that's going to be yours to hold on to and use and love and cherish forever and ever and ever. Um, you should also be getting a blue post-it note to put on the inside. So that blue post-it note does two things. Uh, one, it works as a bookmark. So then you just have an automatic bookmark that you can move from page to page to make things easier on you. The other thing is write your name on it and write my name on it. So that way if they lose this book, we can get it back to you. Because you have to bring this book every single day, and every day you don't have it, I charge you points. And if you lose it, you have to spend $10 to buy a new one. And I don't think any of you want to spend $10 to buy a new book. So make sure we're going to do as much as we can to not lose it. So on that bookmark, that little blue post-it note, you're going to write your name, first and last name, and my name, Broviac, in large letters. Let's see, Broviac, Broviac, right there. So write my name on it in large letters also, so that way if someone finds it, they can get it back to me, and then I can get it back to you. Class period would be nice. It's not required, but it just makes life a little bit easier on you, and then you should be good to go. And that's my way of trying to help you guys out from there. All right, you have um, another video you're getting ready to watch. It's just a different one, depending on which class you're in. Regular kids, you have a video. Advanced kids, you have a video. Um, I'd prefer to be doing it with you in person, but that didn't happen. So it's a video of me teaching it to you guys, so it's not the best, but at least it's something. Uh, I'll be reading and talking and stuff like that, and so it'll sort of like be with me, but not quite with me, but it's like on the big screen. Imagine it's like watching, you know, your favorite teacher in a TV show as he teaches to you, and it's not as exciting as normal, but it's a start. So this is what we'll end up doing, and then hopefully I'll get to be back to you guys on Wednesday, um, as long as my emergency is wrapped up by then. If not, then we'll keep in the loop and we'll figure out stuff. So be good, make good choices, don't spend your brand new points, and I miss you guys, and I'll see you guys soon. All right, bye.